inside the GTO. And we'll go ahead and see if we can go ahead and run him from in here. This guy's 55 through here. 64, we'll let him go. 71 right there. 71 right there. We're going to go ahead and get that guy for 71. Officer John Allington responded with 200 stars. 71 right here, dude. We're going to go ahead and grab him. We got him. All right. We're going to go ahead and get behind him. We're going to go ahead and tell him to pull the vehicle over. Pull over, dude. All right, dude. He's going to go ahead and pull over. Hopefully, either that or he's going to go ahead and run from us today. And then we'll go ahead and be on a traffic stop over here. I don't know what that creepy van's doing over there. Hopefully, they're not giving away any free candy. Let's kind of park like this a little bit so we don't kill anybody. We'll be on a traffic stop. Dispatch, show me on a traffic stop, please. Sean says, what's up, my G? We're chilling like a villain, Sean. Chilling like a villain over here. Bottom left, we're on a traffic stop. Let's go ahead and check this California plate. Dispatch, let me get a plate check. 88 Bravo Edward Union 061, please. Gordon Spencer says, good evening. Scott's in the chat there. Dustin, coming in from Connecticut. How's the weather up there in Connecticut today? All right, Andrew Parkston over here. Andrew Parkston. Let's go ahead and pull this up on the computer. Valid registration, valid insurance. 71 and a 55. 19-year-old kid. Flying down Santa Monica Freeway over here, going 16 over, guys. Failure to stop back in 2020. He does have a handgun permit. Let's go ahead and approach the vehicle. Hopefully, he doesn't shoot at me today. I'm going to put that pipe bomb away. And we're on a traffic stop right now. He's actually going to go ahead and cooperate. We're going to go ahead and speak to the driver over here and say, uh, Good evening. My name's Officer Ristream. You know how fast you were going? What? How fast All right, guys. We can smell narcotics coming from inside the vehicle over here. Uh, I'm going to ask him how he's doing today. Uh, I need a Diet Cola. Well, I'm not going to be having any Diet Cola until Friday over here. It looks like he's all dressed up over there. It is occupied times two. We're going to go ahead and uh, ask him if you know why I pulled you over today. He says, FML, man. All right, dude. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, tell him that he was going 16 over. He says, Ristream, what's the speed limit? I didn't see any signs. It's a 55 down here on Santa Monica Freeway, man. It's 55 down here, okay? Are you sure I was going that fast? I definitely clocked you that fast, man. I clocked you from on the other side of the road. Make sure he's got a seatbelt on. The driver's not wearing a seatbelt either. Which is no bueno on that one. You got to wear your seatbelt out here on Santa Monica Freeway. He says that was definitely a mistake. All right, license registration, proof of insurance. Any idea on you I can look at? Hey, did you hear his, his voice is different as well as well? That's that's pretty cool. 85 in Connecticut today. All right, guys, we got Andrew Parkston over here. Andrew Parkston did give me his uh, information over there, and we're just gonna ask the driver uh, if there's any uh, been marijuana inside the car here. You've been using any drugs recently? I would never ruin my life with drugs and stuff like that. What kind of drugs have you used recently? I dropped some acid a few hours ago or a few days ago. What day is it? Okay. So this guy dropped acid a few days ago. I'm going to tell him I'll be right back with him. Let's go ahead and pull him up in the computer one more time. And I'll ask that passenger for his identification as well. Uh, Andrew Parkston. That's the 19-year-old kid over there. So we're going to go ahead and probably pull both of them out. Let's get a K9 out here. Dispatch requesting a 1032 K9, please. Let's come on the other side of the car here. Let's get some identification from the passenger because I'm not too sure which one of these guys is the one that's high today. Hey, passenger, can I go ahead and get your identification, please? All right, we're going to grab the identification from the passenger, and his name is Dave Hardy. Dave Hardy, thank you so much for the identification. I do appreciate that. Let's wait till the canine gets here, and then we'll go ahead and pull both of them out. We'll see if the marijuana is just inside the car or what kind of drug it is. But I want to see if this guy's wanted by the police. Let's see here. Uh, Dave Hardy, uh, he's a 25 year old guy, so he's six years older than the driver. He has a handgun permit as well and a failure to signal sign, but he's not driving, so that's okay. We just want to make sure that there's no drugs inside the car. Let's come up to the vehicle and let's go ahead and talk to the driver one more time and tell him that we do have a canine coming out here to smell the vehicle. I do have a canine coming up right now, okay, sir? Who's coming? Lucky or Chico? Anybody remember who Lucky is and who Chico is? Let me know in the chat there one time. Which, which type of dog is Lucky and which type of dog is Chico? All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, tell him to go ahead and uh, turn off the engine and step outside. He says, yes, Ristream, I will go ahead and do so. All right, let's go ahead and see if they cooperate with us today. There is, oh, there's the dog. Which one is it, guys? Which one is it? Uh, you love the G6, Ristream? It's a Pontiac uh, GTO. Yes, Pontiac GTO. So the driver said, yes, I will go ahead and step out, but now he's not stepping out. Uh, I'm going to ask him another time. He refused to go ahead and step outside the vehicle. I'll ask him another time. Step outside, sir three times and he's not cooperating with us today all right listen uh i'm gonna go ahead and yank this guy out of the car and throw him in cuffs and then we'll go ahead and search his vehicle okay tommy bartels in the chat there james elliott says lucky's the german shepherd that's right and chico is a pit bull that's correct answers in the chat guys good job on that one guys good job all right let's go ahead and uh pull our our uh what do we want to get out here let's get our uh stun gun out here just in case and we'll go ahead and yank him out of the car since he doesn't want to cooperate with us today and then we'll go ahead and tell him to stay on the ground stay on the ground dude stay on the ground Hey, we got a runner. We got a runner. This guy definitely got weed inside the car. Dude. 
Downtown. Down, running down Santa Monica mm -hmm. Freeway. He's running months. down Santa Monica Freeway, guys. Uh, right in the middle of traffic. Stop, dude. Put your hands Police. up in the air. Get down Let's on the ground. Let's see some friggin' hands, dude. Heather's in the chat there. Says lucky. He just got his head ran over by a car, so he's probably gonna need medical Holy attention over there. Let's go ahead and see if I can go ahead and get this guy in cuffs over here. All right, brother, go ahead and get back down on the ground. Get back down on the ground. Let's go ahead and cuff him up. I'm gonna go ahead and detain him. He's most likely gonna get a resisting arrest charge tonight. Let me tell dispatch we do got one in custody over here. Dispatch, uh, just to let you know, I do have one in custody. Billy, JDK, Tyler, Glenn Peck, um, yes, Ken, you're a legend. Gerald says everybody's a legend in the chat. All, all right, let's grab this. Uh, Red says over the head. Yeah, he, his head just got pancaked over there. Dude, look at the speed of traffic getting on the highway right now. They're flying over here. All right, let's go ahead and bring this guy up here, and I got to go ahead and get that dog ran around. The, oh, the car's gone. So that 25-year-old guy, um got inside the car and for some reason the backup units did not run after him so his partner took off on me over there all right let's ask him why he ran from us today why'd you run dude can i call my parents sir you look a little old to be calling your parents i don't think this guy should be calling his parents over here the full-grown adult over here we're gonna go ahead and uh, tell you that you are being arrested right now for running from me over there now i'm very very suspicious you might have something on you do you have anything in your pockets i need to know about What's your probable cause? Well, I smell drugs inside the car. You told me you dropped some acid. He says I'm too high to reply to your comments. Officer right. Brian Howard Let's pat him down. with 200 stars. He's most likely going to be high on some kind of a drug, and we're going to charge him with a DWI as well. Uh, Dylan Ray, uh, thank you, Heather, for answering his question over there. Da -da 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 -da. Tyler's in the chat there. Samantha. Pop Smoke says, or is it hard drugs? I don't know what kind of drug it is yet. I don't know what kind of drug it is yet. We're going to check here in a second. I've got a book of stamps, some loose change, a black revolver, and a sawed-off shotgun. Sawed-off shotgun. Andrew Parkston. Andrew Parkston, we already knew his name over there. Let's go ahead and ask him why he did not tell me about the weapon that was inside of the vehicle over there. Sir, you did have a weapon inside the vehicle. I mean, inside your pockets over there. And Why did you not tell me about the weapon? I thought you would not find a sawed-off shotgun. Where the frick did you have that at? <laughs> Who does that belong to, man? It's my gun now. I stole it. So he has a stolen weapon on him as well. So we're going to go ahead and uh, what do we want to do now, guys? We got to go ahead and, and uh, we got to do a drug swab on him over here because we want to see if he's high. He already told me he's high and he didn't even know what day it was over there. James Elliott. Uh, let's see here. No, dude, I'm showing pretty good frames over here. I, I'm not frozen on my end, guys. Are you frozen on your end over there? Are you frozen on your end over there, guys? Let me know because it's showing pretty well on my side over here. <laughs> He's positive for marijuana, cocaine, and heroin. Thank you, Sean. I appreciate that, buddy. All right, guys. Oh, this is a spoiler alert. We still have not used this vehicle yet. This is the uh, Chevy Colorado over here. We never used this one yet. We're going to be using this one soon. Uh, he had weapons. Yeah, Pop Smoke. He did have a uh, sawed-off shotgun in his pocket there. Uh, lagging bad, someone says. Really? It says it's good. I'm good. Not here, says Melissa Torres. Tyler says it's good. Okay. Try to X out of Facebook and come back in because it's not showing me on my side that we're lagging. Okay, guys? Uh, let's go ahead and do a weapon serial check here. He did say that he did steal that shotgun. I'm going to go ahead and call it in. Uh, Kilo 35-53670. And it is Andrew Parkston's weapon. It is a valid weapon. So, for some reason, I don't know why he told me it was stolen, but it is definitely not stolen. All right. Guys, get back inside your car. Get back inside your car. We're going to charge him tonight with DWI and resisting arrest tonight. There is the Pontiac GTO. I'm hoping that we go ahead and get into high, some high-speed pursuits tonight. Let's go ahead and go over to Andrew here. Andrew's going to get a speeding ticket tonight for 16 over. Valid registration, valid insurance. Uh, we're going to charge him tonight with resisting arrest and driving under the influence of marijuana cocaine and what was it methamphetamine Mark responded with 247 stars all right we're gonna go ahead and kill our lights and we're gonna go ahead and get out of here thank you mark zuckerberg i appreciate that buddy this special show me has 10 6 we're out of here let's roll out that's all we had to do so his car got uh jacked by his partner over there his partner took off on us so i don't really know what to do in that situation we're just gonna have to let him go and put an apv out for it Go ahead and run some right out here, guys. The 55 through here, 70. Oh, that one would have been a good one right there. Hard to catch these guys coming these fast down the road. 48, 56, 51, 68. Let him go. Try to get somebody in the 70s here if I possibly could. 55, 61, 
Come on, give me somebody good here. Jamie's in the chat there. Oh, yeah, the seatbelt charge. We forgot about the seatbelt. I forget about that seatbelt charge almost every single time here. Let's go ahead and get that guy for 68 right there. 68 and a 55. All right. He already knows exactly what's going on over here. He's, he pulled over immediately. Pull the vehicle over on the shoulder. Thomas, uh, we got Thomas Rogers and Thomas Cap both in the chat there as well saying hello to us. k uh Mike Beaton's here saying hello to us. Big old team for guys. Dispatch, show me in a traffic stop. I don't know if you guys can see those plates, but they actually are California plates today. I was able to go ahead and change it. I think that looks pretty dope. Dispatch, let me get a plate check. 62 Frank Zebra Thomas 836, please. Uh, Lisa says not frozen here. Okay. I'm sorry if it froze on you guys. A warrant. A warrant. Just go out and come back in if it's, if it's frozen. Uh, Johnny Williams apparently has got a warrant over here. Oops, I pushed the wrong button. My bad. Hold on one second. I pushed the wrong button on my keyboard. Uh, Jamie's in the chat there. Says, let's do this. Mike B and James. Uh, Derek Wooten says, what's up, Rich Dream? Dude, we're chilling like a villain over here, man. Chilling like a villain. All right, let's go ahead and pull this guy up over here. Johnny Williams. He's got expired registration as well. 21-year-old male. Officer driving like an idiot. Back in 2021. So this guy was going 13 over. And he possibly... He, this guy doesn't have the warrant, though. He doesn't have a warrant. It says right here, no warrant. I don't know why dispatch said a warrant, but there's no warrant. It's just a registration issue over here. Let's go ahead and come outside the vehicle and we'll approach him and see why his registration's out. And it is occupied times one. And this is not a guy over here, guys. This is definitely a female. Let's say good evening. How you doing today, ma'am? She says she really has to go ahead and pee. Okay. Uh, my kids are stressing me out and they're driving me friggin' nuts. <laughs> well, I can definitely relate to that. You know why I pulled you over today? <laughs> she says, yes, I know exactly why. Yeah, I pulled you over for 13 over. Uh, I was texting. I'm sorry. Okay, she admitted to it. We got to go ahead and remember to go ahead and add a texting while driving charge to her uh, charges over there. I actually pulled you over today, ma'am, for going over the speed limit 13 over, right? She's late for a doctor's appointment, she says. All right, let's go ahead and uh, ask her for a license. You got any idea what you want to look at? Did you hear my new character's uh, voice over there? It sounds pretty cool. All right. Uh, we got Johnny Williams registration and insurance card. The registration expires 7-16-2022. So last month it expired. And this lady's name is... Joanna Detop. Joanna Detop. All right. So I'm going to ask Joanna Detop if she's been drinking at all today. I am friggin' drunk. Am I friggin' drunk? I don't know. Are you? How much have you had to drink tonight? She says a shot of vodka with juice. It got me buzzing over there. Okay. So she's admitting to being drunk. What we're going to do is we're going to ask her to go ahead and step outside the vehicle and turn the engine off. She says shoot frick. I don't know. I don't know anybody that ever says shoot frick, but go ahead and step outside the car. We'll do a DUI checkpoint on the side of the road. Hold it. I'm hoping to go ahead and get into some high-speed pursuits today, guys, with that Pontiac GTO, because that thing's super fresh. Chris says, uh, first live stream. Well, welcome in, Chris. Alana in the chat there. Shane, you'll share it with the exclamation point following. Are we out of Facebook jail? We are out of Facebook jail. Nice job, guys. So, well, thank you so much for putting me into Facebook jail this weekend and breaking my stream, but we are now out. So if you guys want to go ahead and check your followages, you can definitely check them now. All right, ma'am, I'm going to go ahead and do a sobriety checkpoint on you over here. Do you have any questions? She says, I'm trying not to go ahead and catch a charge tonight. Well, we're going to go ahead and see how that goes over here. First of all, let me go ahead and pull my flashlight out. Oh, we got to run it. Dispatch requesting backup. Target last seen heading west on foot and Rockford Hill. We already got a runner over here. We're going to tase her right in the butt cheeks over there. We got butt lightning. Ma'am, stay on the ground. Stay on the ground. Stay on the ground. Stay on the ground. She's trying not to catch a charge, and she thought running down Santa Monica Freeway over here was going to go ahead and free her, but that's not going to work. Kimberly! Says, What's up, wrist stream in the BCE? Kimberly, I am doing well. How are you doing today? We've got one in custody. Attention all units. Suspect in custody. We got one in custody. Why were you in Facebook jail, says Treg? Well, if you were here this weekend, you would know, but we were doing some massive dice rolls over there, so thank you guys so much for participating in that. All right, we got one in custody over here. I don't know why she possibly ran. You must be really, really drunk and you don't want to go to jail, right? I just need to go ahead and get away from my wife, she says. All right, let's go ahead and have her go back up to our car. We'll do a breathalyzer on her and then we'll go ahead and get her transported to jail. She's, she's almost guaranteed to be drunk over here. Brandon Phelps uh, says all knucklehead. All right. Officer Shane let's go ahead and see how drunk she is. 100 stars. GTOs were made before the G8s. The GTOs were holding Moneros while the G8s were holding Commodores. What is what is what does that mean? What does Holden Moranos and Holden Commodores even mean? What does that tell me what that means? 
All right, ma'am. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do a breathalyzer test on you right now. I can guarantee you that she's gonna be drunk over here. Let's go ahead and pull Officer that out. Officer Jeremy Tessier Wasted. responded with 200 stars. That federal signal SLR light bar is awesome. Yeah, dude, isn't it super bright? It's super dope over there. All right, guys, 0 0.209. Way over the legal limit. Way wasted over here. We're going to go ahead and tell her that she is now under arrest for DUI tonight. You're under arrest for DUI, ma'am. Are we going to jail? Yeah, you're going to be going down to the Gray Bar Hotel for that, unfortunately. Um, so since we're going to have to take you to jail, do you have anything illegal in your pocket? What's considered illegal, dog? I'm not your dog for once. I don't know why everybody calls me dog over here, but you have any uh, anything illegal inside that vehicle? She says there might be a gun inside the vehicle. She doesn't have a CCW, so I don't know why... There's a gun in there. I'm going to ask her if she wants a female to pat her down. She says she wants a female officer out here. All right, let's call one out. Dispatch requesting a 1032 female, please. All right, let's go ahead and grab her. And we'll go ahead and get a female officer out here. Uh, Chris says done. Uh, let's see here. Han says Holden is an Australian car. Oh, okay. Holden means Australian. Okay, I did not know what that meant. <laughs> uh, Dakota DeLong over there with the 68 points. Thank you so much, Dakota. Let's wait for the female to go ahead and get here, and I'm gonna go ahead and pull her up in the computer, and then I'll go ahead and search her car one more time. So her name is Joanna. She's 46 years old. She's drunk. She has no handgun permit, so if there is a gun inside the car, doesn't have a CCW for that. We got the state trooper rolling up on us right now. All right, so she wanted a female officer out here to go ahead and pat her down. So if you could go ahead and pat her down, I wanna go ahead and see what's in her pockets. Joanna, go ahead and stand up for us. Let's go ahead and get you patted down over here. Go ahead and pat her down, and then we'll go ahead and search the car. Uh, the TV show Dog the Bounty Hunter, says, uh, Dallas Joyce. Uh, crackheads in the diet call. <laughs> a flash drive, a rusty syringe, some matches, and a key fob on Joanna, uh, over there. So she's got a rusty syringe, so she might also be a drug user as well. Let's go ahead and ask her if she uses any drugs. You do drugs as well, ma'am. She says, I don't like the drugs the way drugs make you feel. Okay, because I did find a syringe in your pocket over there. So I just want to know, uh, let's go ahead and ask. Um, where did you get that uh, syringe at? Whose is that? I swear I'm gonna kick my brother's ass. Okay, so it's her brother's syringe. We're gonna charge her with drug paraphernalia on that one. We're gonna go ahead and search a vehicle. Let's go ahead and see what she did have inside of it. Uh, did, did he finally admitted it? Uh, Joe says, I see the pin comment. What's the pin? I can't actually see the pin comment on my screen because my comments are still broken over here on Facebook. So I can't actually see the pin comment at the bottom. I apologize. Uh, I'm just watching my stream on my other monitor over here. That's the only thing I could do. Facebook actually wrote back to me and, and, and said that they're still looking into it after I think we're at 12 days of it being broken now. She does have a gun inside the car, guys. She told me that there was a gun inside the car. She definitely does have a gun. Let's go ahead and see whose gun that is inside the car. Uh, let's go ahead and just ask her really quickly whose gun that was. All right, ma'am. So you did have a gun inside the car. You did actually tell me about the gun. So thank you for not lying. But uh, who does that weapon belong to? I bought it off of Facebook Marketplace. I don't think that they sell guns in Facebook Marketplace, but okay, that's that's her answer over there. Let's go ahead and do a uh, do, 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 do. let's do a uh, weapon serial check here on the weapon. I'm gonna call that into dispatch. See whose gun that is. Indiana zero six three two nine zero Queen is going to be the registration number, and it's Johnny Williams' gun. So it's actually the owner of the car's gun. It's not her gun. So she's gonna get charged tonight with uh, having a weapon without a CCW. So let's go ahead and uh, tow her car out of here. Larry's here. Uh, what's that warning for me? Did I type something spicy? Dispatch requesting a 1051. Brad says, yo, what's up everybody? We're doing good, Brad Smith, we're doing good. All right, let's get a small tow truck out here on Santa Monica Freeway at the 32 mile marker, please. Tow truck, assistance required in roughly All right, I got a tow truck coming out right now and I am just gonna go ahead and file the charges. Let's go ahead and throw her in the uh, I think this is actually a commercial motor vehicle enforcement vehicle. I don't think it's actually a regular state trooper. Let me go ahead and double check this. Yeah, it is. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and have to. Ch uh, did I use this one? Oh yeah, I did use this one. We did do a. Uh, we did do a DUI stream. I mean, uh, not a DUI. Stream. Why can't I close the door? We did do a uh, semi truck. Come on. Excuse me. I'm trying to close the friggin' door. All right, you can go ahead and get back inside your car. I'm gonna file the charges on her. And then you guys can go ahead and get her out of here and take her to the Gray Bar Hotel. So she's got drug paraphernalia. Uh, she's DUI. And she's got resisting arrest, speeding, and no registration on the vehicle. So she's got a lot of freaking charges over here. <laughs> Let's start with the citations. Uh, 13 over. Uh, we're going to get her with the document charge here for the expired vehicle registration. Those are those two. 
And the reason she's going to jail tonight is driving under the influence. Uh, she doesn't have a suspended. She's got drug paraphernalia. Uh, she's got resisting arrest. And she's also got... Well, what was the other thing? Was that it? I think that was it, dude. I think that was it. Uh, drug possession. Hi. Oh, the gun. The gun. Uh, possession of the firearm without the CCW. Which is going to be up here. I'm sly. I'm... I'm off. I'm, so, I'm, I'm some of your comments today, guys. I'm not understanding what you guys are saying today. Are, are you guys uh, are you guys on that uh, stuff today, or what's going on? <laughs> Bruce Stream, uh, would you be a police officer in real life? Well, I I, I wanted to when I was a kid, but I'm not anymore. This bad. Show me as ten six. All right, let's go ahead and kill our lights, and we're gonna go ahead and get out of here. Copy that. One eight. Uh, oh yeah, texting and driving. All right, well we'll we'll forget about that one. She's got enough charges to go ahead and land her uh, in jail for a, uh, for a little while. So let's go ahead and run our radar in this direction. Then we'll go ahead and do some more stuff a little bit later. All right, let's go ahead and pull our radar gun out here. The 55 through here, guys. 55 through here. 62. 74 right there. 74. Perfect. Let's go ahead and grab him. Oh, <laughs> look at this. Look how wet it is on the ground, dude. Everybody looks like they pulled their e-brake over there. All right, pull over. All right, let's see if this guy will go ahead and pull over on the road. I want to go ahead and get into some high-speed pursuits today, but you never know what's going to happen over here. It's totally random. Uh, Glenn says, are you okay? Yes, are you okay, Glenn? Probably a full moon out. That's probably why. Yeah, it probably is. I uh, love the avatar. What avatar? What avatar are we talking about? This guy, show me on a traffic stop, please. Uh, the hammer lane. Yeah, hammer lane over there is the one that we're running over here. On a traffic stop. Bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Dispatch, let me get a play check. 24 Sam Charlie Frank 627, please. Target's license plate. 24 Sam Charles Frank 627. Gordon says slipstream. I, I don't know what your comments are saying today. What's slipstreaming? Nathan is the guy's name over here. Let's go ahead and pull Nathan up in the computer. Uh, Nathan is valid registration, valid insurance. Nathan is actually a female, okay? Uh, no handgun permits. Got a double parking charge. Uh, planting evidence in strong armed robbery. So she is definitely a criminal. Um, she's not wanted, so she did serve her time. So she's good to go. 34-year-old female over here. Let's go ahead and approach the vehicle and see why she's speeding down the road. First of all, let me go ahead and see how fast she was going again. I forget. She's going 74 and a 55. So 15 plus 4. She was going 19 over, guys. 19 over. Let's go ahead and put that radar gun away and uh, ask her if she knows why I pulled her over. You know how fast you were going? What? Wally says what's up. How fast you were Wayne going. Wayne says what's up. Uh, 65. 63. Officer, isn't, isn't the speed limit 65? Yeah. It is. All right, let's go ahead and say good evening. I'm Officer Ristream. How are you doing today? Ah, oh, bro, what do you want over there? I want to see your license, registration, proof, insurance. You got any ID? On got you any ID? Uh, Adam says, how are you doing today, Ken? Yeah, Ken, how are you doing today, man? Big old 10 for I wasn't able to go ahead and ask Ken how he's doing today. Hopefully he's doing well. <laughs> All right, so we got Nathan's information over here. We don't smell any alcohol or drugs or narcotics coming from the vehicle, which is good. Let's make sure they got their seatbelt done. Driver's not wearing their seatbelt. You know it's a law to buckle up over here in Los Angeles. Sounds good to me, bro. Why do you always call me bro? Everybody's called me bro today. You're the second person. You need to wear your seatbelt next time. I appreciate your concern in, in showing for me, but I'm an adult. Seriously, come on. Okay. All right. Well, I'm definitely going to have to write you a ticket on that one. You know, I pulled you over today for going 19 over on the highway. I think your radar is properly not calibrated. All right, we're going to go out and be right back with you. We're definitely writing her a ticket tonight. She's going to take it for two different things. The patrol car is dope. I know. I'm, I'm super excited to go ahead and get into a high-speed pursuit today. All right, let's go ahead and do uh, 19 over over here, over 15, and then the document. No, not document-related, but we want to get her with vehicle operation for do, 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 seatbelt violation as well. Uh, valid registration, valid insurance, which is awesome. We'll go ahead and come out here, and we'll go ahead and give her the ticket. All right, ma'am, I'm going to go ahead and have to go ahead and give you a citation today. It's going to be $760. If you can't pay the full amount, call 1-800-RISTREAM, okay? I'll escort you back out into the road, and make sure that you wear that seatbelt next time, okay? You understand? Let's see if she understands. I'm going to go ahead and give her her documents back, okay? She says, sweet. All right, sweet. We'll talk to you later. Well, hopefully, you never see me again, but hopefully, I see you again to take you to jail. Let's kill our lights. This guy show me has 10 6. We're gonna go ahead and get out of here and we'll be good to go. I don't know what that guy's doing right there. I do not have time to go ahead and pull them over though. That's uh that's a weird little spot to go ahead and pull over right there. Let's go ahead and come up here, guys, and we'll kind of run some radar in a different direction. Perfect. Perfect. We'll sit right here. 
No, nope, not right there. I don't want to crash. Uh, Austin Dudley. Ken says he's doing a little bit better tonight. Good. All right, we got a GTA in progress. I got to pull over on the shoulder here just for one second to go ahead and take a look at this. Uh, do, 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 do. We got a commercial vehicle theft in progress at 7082 Spanish Avenue in West Vinewood. Dispatch, wrist streaming around. 10 4, copy. 1 8. All right, everybody move out of the way. Everybody move out of the way. Police business. Move it or lose it. Everybody stop. Watch out for the lights in the GTO. All right, this one would have been a good one to go ahead and use on the. Uh, on the. Uh, Oh boy, this thing's hard to turn. Uh, the commercial motor vehicle enforcement stream we were doing. Watch out, dude. We got a Freightliner Cascadia right there. Everybody, watch out. Move it or lose it. Police business. Uh, let's see here. Uh, what type of PC do you have? Uh, I just have a. I have a custom belt PC. I have a no name brand. Watch out. All right, guys. It's gonna be about a quarter mile up the road. We're gonna get a, probably a helicopter up in the air. We're on scene. Dispatch. Uh, Rich stream on scene. 1023. Come outside. Like, oh, he's running from us over here. It's a cattle pot. It's a cattle pot with the Freightliner Cascadia. Affirmative. Attention, all units. Officer requesting backup near um, West Vinewood. All right. Um, I have never seen a semi truck in the city before in the game, guys. Usually, we're on the interstate. That's where the semi trucks are. But today, there's a semi truck uh, going down the city here. This is kind of wild. Smash, smash. I did not crash at all. I didn't crash at all, Shane. I almost. Oh, there's an accident right there. Oh my God! Look at me off track on that. All right, let's go and pursue. Dispatch 1080. All right, let's see if we get authorization for this pursuit right here. There's no way I'm gonna be able to put that out. We have to do spikes. Or shoot his tires. There's a crash. Okay, we're authorized. We are authorized for the pursuit over here. Let's go ahead and get a helicopter out there. Dispatch requesting air support. He got into another accident. That's two accidents he's at fault at. Uh, Matt Seaman, Karen Love Dingle in the chat. They're saying hello to us. Uh, Shane says I always am. He says do a pit. I can't do a pit on that with this little GTO. <laughs> Where's my backup? Dispatch requesting backup. I don't need a backup officer out here. Crash. Doing 40 mile an hour only? Let's see how fast he's actually going here. He's going 57. I don't know what she's talking about. Okay. We got a backup unit in front of us. Anybody have any suggestions except for pipe bomb? No pipe bomb right now. Towards the end of the stream, we'll do pipe bombs. Eric Epson says happy Monday. Tommy says shack accident. Custom built computers are my personal favorite. Yes. Yes. David Hilton says happy Monday. Yeah, happy Monday. It's a good Monday for me, though. Usually, usually I'm dragging a little bit on Mondays. But oh, my God. There's another friggin' accident right there. He Destruction of uh, private prop, uh, public property right there. Taking out the light poles. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. I guess we're going to have to shoot his tires out. Uh, or let me try the spike strip. Let's see what happens. Dispatch requesting spikes. We do got a helicopter up in the air somewhere. There he is. See him? Okay. Uh, he's going to crash. He's going to crash. Okay, we got him. We got him. Let's go ahead and move over here to our uh, to our gun. Stop, driver. Driver, stop. Get outside the vehicle with your hands up. Get out. Get out of the vehicle. Get down on the ground. Get down. Get down on the ground. We got him, dude. We got him. 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 Nice job right there. If he didn't crash, I don't know what we were going to do. Because it's hard to do the spike strips in the city over there. Go ahead and relay this information over to dispatch. We got one in custody, dispatch. Attention all units. Suspect apprehended. Yep, suspect apprehended. We got him. Roadblock? Yeah, it's it's hard. Try to do a pit when they're turning, Attention says Black. Officer Shane El Yoshihara responded with 100 stars. Sawed off shotgun hand on the pump. Sipping on a 40 yo smoking on a blunt bust. My gun and red and meth getting jump la 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 la. Freaking hell. You are freaking out, man. What in the world does that mean, dude? What, was that a song that you just made up? Are you rapping for me over there, Shane Yoshera? All right, dude. What in the friggin' world are you doing over there? Why did you uh, go on that high-speed pursuit? Got into two acts, uh, three accidents over there and destruction of uh, public property over there. What happened? He says, I'm trying not to go ahead and catch a charge tonight. Well, you're definitely catching a charge 
Where, uh, where are you coming from with that semi truck? Coming from my friend's apartment over there. Okay, copy that. Let's go ahead and see if he's actually stole this. Uh, is this vehicle yours or did you steal it? It belongs to my friend Tim. Okay. All right, so he's saying it's his friend's vehicle. We're not smelling any alcohol or narcotics. You have anything illegal inside your pockets I need to know about, sir? What's considered illegal? Dog. I'm not your dog over there, dude. Anything that's going to stab, stick, or poke me? Any knives, syringes, bombs, grenades, IEDs? <laughs> that was Redman and Method Man. That he oh, that's what Redman and Method Man you were rapping for me over there, Shane. Okay, I did not know that. Okay, guys, so we got some weed in his pocket. Two things of weed and a ballistics knife. And this is Mr. James Noland over here. James Nolan, let me know if you are in the chat tonight, guys. This guy smokes weed. It's time to smoke, smoke, smoke weed, 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 weed every day. All right, Red. Josh says littering and uh, littering and uh, probably smoking the reefer. That's probably what he was probably doing over there. All right, we're good to go. You want to know why I pulled you over? Littering. Oh, officer, that, that's not ours. Candy bars. Littering and... Littering and, uh, and uh, littering and littering and uh, littering and littering and littering and use that 95 mask. Littering and smoking the reefer. All right, guys, we got it. James Barnett says, "What's up, stream?" Adam Nunnery, James Elliott, bald headed thought. There's the bald, there's the uh, littering and stickers in the chat. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. There we go. Look at all of you guys in the chat. Kena, Adam, Brian, this Shepard, Nick, Ashback. Yes. Report. Attention, all units. Yep, we're on that traffic Officer stop Ron still. Shaw responded with one Still on the traffic stop. It's crime fighting time. It's crime fighting time. We're we're fighting finding criminals today. Dispatch, let me get a play check. Four six Echo Echo King five seven two, please. Suspect license stolen. Edward, he lied. Edward King, five, seven, two. He lied. Stolen vehicle. He told me it was his friend Tim's vehicle, guys. It is not Tim's vehicle. It's Ethan Feldor's vehicle. Ethan Feldor. Look at my character over here. He's looking super dope. Let's go ahead and pull up James Nolan. James Nolan, are you in the chat tonight, buddy? I know that you're usually in my streams. Let me know if you are here. This is you over there. David Hardman, how you doing, buddy? I see in the chat. 28 years old, James Nolan. No priors on his record. No handgun permits. But he did have some butt in his pocket over there and a ballistics knife, which is illegal over here. I know it's not illegal in real life in California, guys, but I charge him with it anyway. All right, dude. We're going to go ahead and be taking you down to the Gray Bar Hotel tonight. We're going to arrest you tonight for that marijuana. Uh, my drug, my drugs, my issues. Yeah, for the drugs. And you're also in possession of a stolen semi truck over here with the trailer on the back. I admit I stole the car and we're going to charge him with all those accidents as well. He says, I admit it, I stole the vehicle, and I'm very, very sorry about it. Hey, at least he's sorry. All right, let's go ahead and do this, and we'll go ahead and charge James tonight with a bunch of charges. We're going to get him with leaving the scene of an accident, reckless driving. Um, he's not smelling like alcohol or narcotics, so that's fine. We're going to get him with evading arrest, high-speed pursuit, uh, do, 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 do destruction of public property. Uh, we'll get him with the drugs for the devil's lettuce over there. And we'll also go ahead and uh, charge him with... What else did he do over there? He had that ballistics knife. Possession of a deadly weapon. Can't have the ballistics knife out there. So there's his rap sheet right now, guys. Now he's definitely going downtown for quite a long time. It's Mr. James Nolan. Dispatch requesting a 1016, please. Let's get a transport unit out here. Assistance required in Rockford Hills. Let me go ahead and move my car up here on the sidewalk real quick. And then we're going to go ahead and get a heavy wrecker over here as well. I want to move it because sometimes the heavy wrecker will go ahead and just smash into you a million times. If I'm ever a character, can you put me in a Vir Virginia Tech t-shirt? No, unfortunately, I can't change every single person's t-shirt. I, I just have It's just random whatever you're wearing and who your character shows up as. I love this Wilson cattle pot over here, though. This is super dope. It's so chromed out. He stole it, though. He tried to get away from me. Uh, I love your stream. I watch him all the time, says Adam. Adam, thank you, man. I appreciate that, boss. Shout out, please, says Pete. Pete, how are you doing today, buddy? Thanks for coming in. All right. He's now going to jail. I don't know if you guys saw my stream. Officer Matt Hartcorn responded Take a look at this one. 100 stars. Today Mustang. makes a year since I started following you, and I'm so glad I did love the hashtag BC. Absolutely, dude. Like button for Rish. Dude, big old tan for Absolutely. Big old tan for Thank you, Matt. I appreciate that. A year of followage out there from Matt. Make sure you guys slam that like button. Let's get a 1051 out here. Dispatch requesting a 1051, please. Give me a heavy wrecker over here. Officer Shane We're on Dorset Drive. With stars. Dorset Drive. Why don't you join me and we can be the next Method Man and Red Man doing our own version of Da Rockwilder. <laughs> oh, you and Joe. You, sometimes you just have my brain just rattled over here, both of you guys. I just try to keep up with you guys. All right, the semi-truck is now on the wrecker. 
And we'll see if he can go ahead and get him towed out of there. Hopefully it could. All right, man. That's your job to go ahead and get him out of there. I'm not helping you, okay? You're good to go. All right, we're, uh, we're going to be code four. All right, dispatch, we're code four. Cody Lee Hopkins, Glenn Peck. Attention, all units. Vincent, no 241 units days. Appreciate that. Uh, dispatch, show me as 10-6, please. Roger that. One, all right, guys, we're 10-6. We're going to be ready to rock and roll. Let's get over here. Oh, excuse me. I'm going through red lights today. Units. Going through red lights. Uh, Pete says good morning from the United Shit. Kingdom. Hey, good morning, man. From the United Kingdom. Great to come in and say hello to us. Uh, 24 years. That's 24 years in jail for a stolen vehicle. Is that what you're trying to tell me? We've got a Grand Theft Auto in progress on a steelway. All right. What does that say? All right, guys. We got a report of a stolen vehicle. It looks like it's a wrist stream merchandise vehicle. 10 4 dispatch. Wrist streaming route. Go code 3. Acknowledged. One, eight. All right, let's go ahead and try to catch up to him, guys. It's another truck. Another truck pursuit over here. So it should be a very, very slow moving pursuit. Watch out. Move it or lose it. Police business. Police business. Watch out. Beautiful. Well, look at the inside of this GTO. It's super fire. Excuse me. Can I squeeze through there? We got it. We got it. Uh, I've been watching you for years, says Skylar. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, I've been on here for three years. So, I mean, two and a half years. So, well, I appreciate that, buddy. All right, let's go ahead and come up here. James Nolan, 111 days, and I'll be following you for eight years. Hey, dude, that's awesome. All right, he's going to be... Oh, shit. All right. Guys, so when I crashed like that, this guy died. Attention Dispatch requesting air support. Officers My engine died. Responded My engine died. Stars. Guys, he can't see all the comments for all the shout outs you want. Please be patient. Yeah, guys, I can't see all the comments. I do apologize. Herbie, Brad, Jordan, Mark Serco. Shane says, hey, dirty. I got you money over there. Well, big old team for it. All right, guys, I'm going to try to go ahead and open up the hood here. The engine did die. So let's go ahead and see if I can go ahead and fix this real quick. See if I can open up the hood. Uh, let's see. Open that hood up here. It should open. We need a helicopter because we're deaf. I can't get it. The problem is, is this guy died. <laughs> this guy, I friggin' slammed into him over here. That was a failure on my part. Let me back his car up a little bit. Call an ambulance out here. Oh, his car's dead too. Great. This is just perfect. Okay. Now I could push these out of the way. Let's get an ambulance. Dispatch requesting a 1052. I think I'm going to jail tonight. Ambulance. Assistance required in Vinewood Hill. I think I'm going to be going to jail tonight for that one. Here we go. Let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and push this out of the way. The problem is, is we're right next to each other here. Okay, I'm pushing it. I just need to push them out of the way so I can go ahead and reach the hoods here. I guess I, I guess my car's in neutral right now. There we go. <laughs> I'm going to jail myself. Yeah, I am. All right, let's go ahead and see if I can fix this one and then move this on. I'm going to lose that truck. We're definitely going to fail that mission. Go ahead and see if I can fix this. Come on. Fix the car. I'm going to open up the hood here. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and work on it real quick here. See if I can go ahead and tinker around with that. Uh, Leonard Richard Dunlap uh, saying hello. Skylar says come and get a shout out. Come on. All right. Skylar, what's up, man? Big old tan for uh, that vehicular homicide wrist stream. Yeah, that was my fault. I was trying to go ahead and get around that other car on this back road here, and I slammed into this one. I'm definitely going to jail. Will be my last... Uh, Patrol in a while over here. All right, I was able to go ahead and get that one. Let me push that out of the way a little bit more. And then I'll be able to go ahead and fix my car. Excuse me, guys. Can you just hold on a second? Okay, they did take the guy. He is now in the hospital right now. So he did not die, guys. That means that he did not die. Okay. Give me one second to go ahead and uh, push this out of the way. There's a driver in the vehicle, it's telling me. No driver in the vehicle. I'll go ahead and just start his car up and move it out of the way. I was going to push it out of the way, but I think you can only push it when the car is broken. I'm not really used to this one too much over here. Let's go ahead and see if I can fix this here. See if I can open up the hood. Hmm. Huh. Some reason I can't open up the hood on this one. All right. Well, my car is going to be SOL over here, I guess. My car is definitely dead. I can push it, but I can't get it started over here. Maybe I could do a push start. Is this a... Is this a manual transmission or not? Let's see if it works now. Nope. Still dead. All right. Let's do a hard reset on it. Let's see if that'll work for us. Nope. Nothing. Still dead. Huh. 
Okay, we got it. Good, good, good. Dispatch 1080. I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely lose this guy. He is two miles away. He is way out there. Should I cheat a little bit? Look where he is. I'm gonna cheat a little bit, guys. We don't have time for that. Yep, we lost him. We lost him. Suspect was lost over there. Suspect was lost. Let me go ahead and relay this information to dispatch. Suspect lost. Attention all units. Suspect evaded pursuing officers. So, I guess there's not going to be any giveaway this weekend. I apologize, guys, because someone stole the merchandise. Dispatch, show me as 10 6. Somebody stole all of our merchandise. Roger that. One so, eight. we are not going to be doing a giveaway this weekend. I apologize about that. <laughs> Nick Hashback says, when in doubt, pipe bomb out. Yeah, I think that's a pretty cool feature. All units, we have shots fired at an officer in Grande Sonora Desert. Felony stop. All units respond. Shots fired. Uh, panic alert button was pushed. Uh, 4014 Joshua Road. Dispatch, we're streaming route. 10 4, copy. 1 8. All right, here we go. We're in route. All right, let's try to go ahead and catch up to this one. Hopefully, Ristream can go ahead and do something right today. Savannah, Eric Gibson, Robert in the chat there with the pipe bomb. Epic failure. We're going to be on scene 1023. Dispatch 1023. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. 10 4. Um, affirmative. Drop it. Drop it. Driver. Drop it. He's down. He's got a gun. Got him in the head. Drop it, dude. Drop it, drop it, drop it. Drop it. Move over to our taser. He's kind of down for the count. He's getting shot at. Drop it, dude. This guy got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bullets in him right now. All right, he's good to go. All right, he's good to go. He, he's down for the count. He's wasted over there, guys. Adam Rainey has been on the force right, for two let's months. Let's go ahead and tell dispatch that we got uh, two people uh, injured over here. Two people injured. Grab these guns as well. 10 4. Is medical aid required? Affirmative. Send out medical. Let's grab this gun as well. We'll go ahead and see what this guy's name was. Ambulance. Tyler says, Yes, sir. Joe says, Stolen Ristry merchandise. Desert. Nope. The mods underground in the black market. My next investigation. <laughs> Uh, nice work, boss. Thank you, Skylar. Bald-headed John. Uh, Nick Hashback in the chat there. He's got a GoPro and a court notice. And this is our buddy, Mr. Ken Perry. Ken Perry. I haven't seen you in a hot minute, dude. Ken Perry, where have you been, my dude? Hopefully you are well. Very quiet in the chats. Ken Perry, let me know if you're here today. Bro, you have a hole in your chest. Yes, I do. I have a hole right through my friggin' chest right there. But it is not next to my heart, guys. I'm not next to my heart, so I'm, I'm fine. I'm gonna have to get myself cleaned up over here. Let's go ahead and see what this dude's name was. And the ambulance is going to be now on scene as well. They're going to go ahead and try to revive those guys. I think they're definitely both going to be dead. All right, this is Brandon Faith. Brandon Faith, let me know if you're in the chat. Ken Perry and Brandon Faith and James Noland are the people that we pulled over today. Uh, people that are in our BCE over here. we got a plane ticket to Mexicano and a Samsung S21. Um... Now, the problem here is I can't see if this vehicle is stolen or not because I can't read those license plates. Let's see if I can go ahead and zoom in here a little bit. Can you read that? Oh, boy, I cannot read that at all. It's kind of in a bad spot. There we go. Dispatch requesting a plate check. 89 Zebra X-Ray Yankee 649. Suspect license plate 89 er Zebra X-Ray Young 649er. A possible stolen vehicle. Okay, it's a stolen vehicle. Proceed with caution. The stolen vehicle. Let me push this up here a little bit. Just like this, and then I will uh, go ahead and search the vehicle and see what these knuckleheads had inside the stolen vehicle over here. The ambulance is now reviving those two people. There's a hole in his soul as well. <laughs> we got an unopened liter of cola inside the vehicle over here, guys. Give me a uh, liter of cola. A what? A liter of cola. Liter of cola. Do we make liter of cola? Officer James C. Noland responded with two hundred stars in the chat. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I'm in the chat. Thank you, James. Thanks for being here, buddy. I was able to go ahead and pull you over before. All right, dispatch. Send out a uh, tow truck on West Joshua Road over here, please. Eric Gibson, Ryan McKee, Quinton, and Brad Smith. 
Okay, guys, so both of these... Robbie Renna has been on the oh, no, this guy's okay. Months. This guy did survive. I did shoot him right in the friggin' temple, too. And he was able to go ahead and survive over there. So Ken Perry survived, but uh, uh, Brandon Faith did die. Dispatch requesting a 1079, please. We got a whole situation going on here right now. Let me close traffic. Look at these two drug addicts in the car. What are they doing? What are they doing in there? Freaking out. You are freaking out. All right, let's get a uh, dispatch requesting traffic control. There's a tow truck. They got the stolen vehicle. Uh, stop traffic. Attention all units. Officer requesting traffic control near right. Grande Sonora Desert. All right, we're good to go. Once uh, the... Wait. Oh, no, the medics are still here. I didn't even know the medics were still here. Well, they had three people to go ahead and revive, I guess. They had to revive the uh, officer that's down. And then they had to revive those two other people. So I didn't even realize the medics didn't even look at that guy yet. Let's go ahead and see if Brandon's okay. Brandon is definitely dead as well. Brandon is dead. They're going to go ahead and give uh, that backup officer a med pack, and he's going to be okay. Good to go. All right, so there's a dead body. All right, so what else do we got to do over here, guys? Nothing. I think we're done. I'll go ahead and take care of the situation. We're going to be code four. Let me get back inside my car here. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I'm going to have to kind of back all the way out of here. Uh, you still need to check the third guy. The third guy is a, a police officer. I don't need to check him. There's only two people over there. I need to find a, uh, a Kleenex wife here. Hold on a second. I think I have some inside the car because my character is definitely full of blood. Uh... Dispatch, uh, I'm mean, gonna need some Kleenex wipes out here. Okay, now we're cleaned up. All right, we're good. Dispatch, uh, we're code four. Attention all units, code four. No additional officers needed. Show me as 10-6 as well. Kill our lights. We're gonna go ahead and get out of here. We're gonna make our way back up to the highway. And we'll go ahead and run some more radar. Unless we go ahead and get another call. If we get another call, then we'll come back down here. Thank you, Mark. I appreciate that, buddy. Our first five of the stream over there. Thank you, buddy. Go ahead and swipe down on your notifications, guys, if you are new to the stream and you want one of those subs over there and you want to get your name added to the game. Uh, Amy with the hashtag Mark. John's in the chat there uh, saying hello. Hello back to you, buddy. Uh, what's the title of this game? It's tagged right on the stream that you're watching. If you click the, the, the tag over there or you type an exclamation point playing, it'll tell you. It's called Grand Theft Auto 5. Uh, thank you. Hashtag Mark is absolutely right. All right. While we make our way up there, I'm going to run some of these license plates because the highway is quite a ways up here. And we'll go ahead and see if we go ahead and find any stolen cars or anything like that. I'm going to break the law and just pass everybody over here. Somebody was asking me during my ATS stream over there uh, if I could drive normally on this game. I, I just I just don't want to drive normally on this game. I don't know why. Uh, one of the first notes, he's a beast at this game. All right, guys, we got a vehicle back here, guys. A stolen vehicle. Stolen vehicle. 4-5 Nancy. 4-5 Nancy. It's a Packard. So it's a semi-truck. It's stolen right here, guys. 4-5 Nancy. I believe this is it. The problem with semi-trucks, guys, is the license plate's up front. So this freight shaker right here, I'm going to go ahead and get him pulled over. Let's light him up. And we'll go ahead and see if he'll go ahead and pull over on the shoulder. Driver, pull over. This might be our, our second high-speed pursuit of the stream over here, guys. And it seems like it's all big trucks today that are pursuing us. I want a sports car to go ahead and pursue us. He's not pulling over. All right. He's not pulling over. We might have to call this out as a pursuit. Let's give him a couple seconds here. See if he, he does have his blinker on. Never mind. He does have his blinker on. He's going to pull over for us. He's going to cooperate. I think he's got his blinker on at least. Is it on or not? Yeah, it is on. Okay, he is pulling over. That took him so long to pull over. He might be hiding drugs, guys. Dispatch, show me on a traffic stop. We're going to get felony backup out, out here as well. Because I think this is the stolen vehicle. Because my uh, my camera did check this. Dispatch, requesting felony backup, please. Uh, RL Thomas is here. Tyler says get him, Restream. All right. We are getting felony back about here right now. David Phillips has been on the force for Let's see months. which way they come from over here. Okay, it's going to be the state police is going to go ahead and back us up on this one. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. All right, he's going to go ahead and get out. I'm going to go ahead and get out. And we're going to come out of guns a-blazing over here. Let's get our heavy pistol. Driver, step outside the vehicle. Walk back towards the sound of my voice. Walk back. Step backwards. Keep walking backwards. You're clear. You're clear. You're clear. Good, 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 good. Go ahead and stop right there. Get down on your knees. Interlock your fingers above your head. All right, he's good to go. He's hands above his head. I'm going to go ahead and tell Jimmy over here. Jimmy, come around and go ahead and cuff him up, Jimmy. 
I'm gonna go ahead and clear. Actually, that might be Larry. Larry! <laughs> Let's see if Larry can go ahead and cuff him up. Larry! Put him in cuffs, brother! I'm gonna tell Larry to go ahead and cuff him up. Larry! What's going on here? Larry, Larry's not gonna go ahead and put him in cuffs. Okay. Larry, I guess I will go ahead and put him in cuffs. Uh, usually I like when Larry puts him in cuffs, but... Okay, never mind. Never mind. It looks like... No, that's Steve, actually. That's actually Steve. I wasn't able to actually tell who that is. That's actually Steve. Alright, so he is supposed to be in cuffs right now. It looks like he cuffed him, but he didn't. Let me go ahead and cuff him. He's got some slurred speech over here, guys. This guy might be under the influence of al alcohol. Is this a 5M server? This is not a 5M server, no. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. And Bi and Billy, no sleeves out here, stilling semis. Okay, let's go ahead and drag this guy on the shoulder. We're going to go ahead and ask him uh, what's going on over here tonight. And I'm going to go ahead and check to see if that's a stolen semi truck. All right, dude. As of right now, you are just being detained until I figure out what's going on. But apparently this vehicle's showing up that it's stolen over here. So you're just being detained, okay? Just take me to jail, he says. Okay. All right. I can definitely do that. Um, uh, do you own this vehicle? I stole it. Okay, well, you're going to jail. All right, I don't even need to check the vehicle. I'm going to check it anyway, but he obviously did admit to stealing it. Do you have anything illegal inside your pockets? Honestly, if I do, it's not mine. Let's go ahead and pat this guy down and see what the guy's name was. He admitted to it. I mean, usually everybody lies to me over here. I have to catch him in a lie, but not today. But John, no, this is not 5M. A Ziploc baggie of marijuana, a Jolly Rancher, and a Starbucks receipt. And this is Mr. James Benedict. James Benedict got the marijuana in his pocket. Alright, let's go ahead and put him in the uh, state trooper uh, Ford F-150 over here and then he'll get transported to jail because this is the only vehicle that I actually put him in because the other vehicle that backed me up over there was a uh, Challenger Dodge Demon over there. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, put him in there and then we'll go ahead and file the charges on him. Let's double check just to make sure that it is a stolen vehicle. Dispatch, let me get a play check. 4-5 Nancy Victor. Nancy, 2-2-0 plays. Flashers in the chat. I know. I see Jaden in the chat. I see Olaf saying hello to us. Stolen vehicle. Stolen vehicle. It's stolen vehicle. Okay. Charles Anderson is the registered owner of that vehicle over there. Let's go ahead and see what we find in here. So we got possession of marijuana, stolen vehicle, and uh, it took him a long time to pull over, which is not a charge. He's got a pair of Yeezys in there. Nothing else of interest. Let's go ahead and get a tow truck out here. Dispatch requesting a 1051, please. Hey, Ray Simpson, I see your big old finger over there saying hello to us. How's your day going, buddy? Dispatch requesting a 1051. I need a heavy wrecker out here on Route 68 at the 142 mile marker, please. Tow truck. Assistance required All right. on Route 68. We're going to go ahead and have our backup officers get back inside their vehicles. Uh, and I am going to go ahead and file the charges on that guy with the stolen vehicle. So let's hop inside here. Pull this up in the computer real quick. And we'll go ahead and go to Mr. James Benedict over here. Right. And we're going to go ahead and arrest him tonight. For possession of a stolen vehicle. Attention all units. And Officer possession Mark of responded marijuana. with 500 stars. Glad possession to send gifted marijuana. subs. Possession of marijuana. Want everyone to have a chance to join the BCE Absolutely. and party with the man myth legend Rish. Thank you, buddy. I definitely appreciate that. And thanks for the first bombski this stream as well, bro. All right, we're gonna go ahead and go 10-6. This bad show me as 10-6. Guys, make sure you are swiping down on your notifications. That was very, very nice. Of Mark Officer Circo. Ryan McKee responded with 100 stars, cooking my famous chili tonight. Ooh! Do you what? want some rich? Yes. On the floor yes, laughing. yes, 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 and yes. Absolutely. What do you put in your chili? I'm very picky eater over there, Ryan McKee. So the chilies that I do eat cannot have chunky tomatoes or onions in them. Yeah. I'm kind of a baby when it comes to stuff like that. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and kill that ALRP system. I want to go ahead and get up on the highway and run some radar up here. Loving this Pontiac GTO. I have another fire car that I want to use sometime this week as well. Uh, well, I guess we're not going to be in the city anymore. I was trying to patrol Santa Monica Freeway, but I guess not today. I guess we're going to be out here on the, uh, on the highway because I'm not driving all the way back to the city. I don't have time for that. My shift, I got about another hour left of my shift over here, so might as well just stay out here. Uh, there should be a nice spot to pull over right here. Pull that e-brake. And we're going to hop inside the car here, guys. And we're going to go ahead and run some forward-facing radar. It's a 55 through here, guys. 55, okay? You can see at the bottom of your screen how fast everybody's going. Uh, you got a Victor bar tonight. Yeah, we got a couple going down to the Gray Bar Hotel tonight. Yeah, we do. Sean, uh, Shane, 
Uh, we have arguments about lawyers in our video games. Weed is legal in the game. Yeah, weed's illegal in the game, guys. Um, it's just a video game. So we charge everybody with uh, marijuana possession just for another charge over there, okay? Because back in the day, marijuana used to be illegal. Attention all units. Nowadays, Officer Jeremy legal. Tessier responded with 100 stars, Rish Slide. The Rish Slide, the Rish Power Slide over there. Dude, where is everybody? Traffic is uh, dead as a doornail. I'm gonna get myself turned around right here. We're gonna go ahead and run it in this other direction here. 73 right there, that, that uh, I don't know what that is, is it a Chevy? If it's a Chevy, hopefully it doesn't drive it to the levee and, and uh, it's dry. All right, let's go ahead and fire it up. <laughs> Lights on, sirens on, tell the vehicle to go ahead and pull over, pull over, dude. 73 and a 55 over here, this is gonna be a good one. There's not really a lot of room to pull over. I don't like Attention pulling people all, over on this road Officer here. Officer Ryan McKee responded that's okay. with 100 stars. We uh, wouldn't like mine then. Yeah. It has onions in it. Okay. Dot. I'll yeah. share a pic on the supporter page when okay. I'm done. All right. I'm, sh I'm sure it's delicious, man. I'm sure it's delicious. But yeah, I'm just a super picky eater. I always tell you guys that. This best show me on a traffic stop, please. In Canada, weed is legal as well. Yeah, it's legal in California. It's legal all over the place. All right, uh, dispatch, let me get a play check. Uh, 23 Thomas Alpha Echo 057, please. Suspects license plate 23 Tom Adam Echo right. 057, a traffic violation. Okay, James Mullins over here. James Mullins is the registered owner of the vehicle. Valid registration, valid insurance. 24 year old male over here, improper passing on the vehicle. Uh, he got charged with 2019. It said that there was a violation on the vehicle. I'm not seeing any violations over here though. I don't know what dispatch is talking about. We're looking for James Mullins. James Mullins going 73 and a 55. Going to approach the vehicle and see what James is doing tonight. I was, I was kind of wishing James would run for me. You know how fast you were going? All right. How fast you were All right, going. let's introduce ourselves as good evening. How you doing today? We can smell alcohol and narcotics coming from the vehicle. He says he knows that he was speeding today. Uh, yeah, dude, I clocked you over there at, uh... We just become best friends, yep! Yes, we did. 18 miles an hour over the speed limit, dude. You were flying. Holy crap, brother. I didn't realize I was going that fast. Absolutely. Let's make sure he's got his seatbelt done. The driver is wearing his seatbelt, which is awesome. Let's go ahead and get your license, registration, proof, and insurance tonight. Jaybird's in the chat there. Again? Jeremy Tesler and Jim is definitely legal in Arizona as well. All right. Well, thank you for telling me the law, guys. All right. So this is James Mullen registration and insurance, but it's James Marsh's driver's license all right james i'm gonna go ahead and be right back with you okay and we can also smell alcohol and narcotics coming from the vehicle so let's go ahead and get a uh we'll do it we'll do a sobriety checkpoint on the side of the road actually you know what i'll do it a little bit differently this time let me pull this guy up in the computer so he's in james mullins vehicle but this is james marsh so james marsh does have an ex this is what they were talking about on dispatch they have an expired driver's I license by 275 days so almost a year of having an expired driver's license uh so that's gonna be a ticket, guys. But we got more that we gotta go ahead and worry about over here. We gotta worry about him being DUI tonight. Let's go ahead and question the driver and see if he's had anything. All right, brother, you been drinking at all? Uh, I wish I had one more beer right now. Okay, do you consent to a breathalyzer? He says, what if I say no? So I guess he says no to that question. How much have you had to drink? What does it really matter? Yes, it does really matter how much you've been drinking because I could smell, you smell like a friggin' brewery, dude. You can send to a sobriety checkpoint. He says he's a... Okay, so we're not going to do it the other way since he doesn't consent to that. Uh, we're going to tell him to go ahead and step outside the vehicle. He says, oh my God, seriously? You just consented to a sobriety checkpoint. You have to do it outside the vehicle. He's refusing to go ahead and step outside. I'm going to ask him again. He's refusing uh, once again to step outside three times. And he is refusing three times to go ahead and step outside the vehicle. So we're going to go ahead and come up to our car. And I'm going to go ahead and call another unit out here to go ahead and back us up. Dispatch requesting traffic backup, please. Eldon, Brian says tow that car out of there. He's probably drunk. He's refusing to go ahead and get out. So he's probably uh, definitely drunk. Oh, thank you, Joe, um, Jaybird. I'm sure your notifications are already turned on. But definitely a good idea for those of you in the chat that don't have your notifications turned on. If you guys are already following, type an explanation point notify in the chat. It'll get all your notifications turned on. So once I go live, it'll pop up in your little notification bar on your phone. Uh, I don't know if you have an iPhone, how that works, but <laughs> definitely works on Android. I'll tell you that. I definitely wish I had one more beer right now. I'm, uh, I'm on the toilet. Oh my God, Shane, TMI on that one. All right. Attention this is, uh, this is Larry. Officer I believe. Chase Reed responded That's with Larry. 200 stars. Larry, he says, "Hey, Ristream, go ahead, and I'm ready to rock and roll." Okay, Larry's gonna help me go ahead and get him out of the car. Chase, thank you so much for the 200, brother. I definitely appreciate that. And if you guys are commenting and I did miss your comment, don't get mad at me. 
I'm still having some problems with Facebook over here. It's still broken on my end, okay? All right, dude, this is your last opportunity uh, to go ahead and please step outside the vehicle before I forcefully remove you to go ahead and step out. He says, oh my God, seriously. Yeah, dude, seriously, step out. I got a backup officer over here. Okay, he's gonna refuse. I'm gonna go and get my stun gun out and I'm gonna yank him out, dude. Friggin' yank you out, how about that? All right, let's go ahead and tell him to stay on the ground. Stay on the ground, dude. Police, hands up now. Hands up, brother, get down on the ground. I'm gonna go ahead and cuff him up and detain him real quick since he's not cooperating with us today. All right, stop traffic. Dispatch, requesting traffic control. Stay on the ground, dude. Stop traffic. Attention all units. Officer requesting traffic control. All right, we're good. Grande I wish I had a cigarette, says Jason. No, <laughs> David uh, no, Rosenberg, why can't you? Are you at work right now? Or why can't you have a cigarette if you really want one that bad? Uh, I'm just making sure all my notifications are working. My followage is not displaying. Try it again. We are out of Facebook jail, so I don't know why it wouldn't be showing over there. All right, we're going to go ahead and grab and drop this guy right here. I'm going to ask him. What's the reason why you didn't want to get outside the vehicle? And I call my parents. Now, we're not calling any parents over here, brother. No parents, okay? What we're going to be doing now is we're going to be doing a sobriety checkpoint on you over here. So, Larry. Actually, is that Steve? That's actually Steve again, guys. It's hard to tell between Steve and Larry. Actually, actually Steve. All right. So, he blew a 0 0.147, guys. He's definitely wasted. That means he's over the limit and under arrest. He's going down to the slammer tonight, down to the Gray Bar Hotel. All right, let's go ahead and talk to him over here and tell him that he's going to jail. All right, man, you're under the influence of alcohol. You're going to jail tonight, okay? He says, I deserve this. All right, man, anything illegal inside your pockets I should know about? What's your probable cause? DUI and you're going to jail. DUI and you're going to jail. Let's have uh, Steve patch you down. I'm going to clear traffic control. Dispatch, clear traffic control, please. He's patting him down in the background back there. All right, traffic's going to go ahead and slowly start moving. Come on, guys. Nice and easy, nice and easy, nice and easy. All of you guys start rolling. Good, good, good. All right, he's got a Ziploc baggie of green capsules, which is marijuana, a GoPro, and a Dunkin' Donuts receipt. More marijuana. It's time to smoke, 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 we, 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 weed every day. All right, guys, another person with marijuana over here. We had almost four, three or four people now that had marijuana in the stream today. Absolutely weird. Uh, I'm wearing cargo shorts. Also, Trucker with a flip-flop. Yeah, almost all the truckers in this game actually got flip-flops on. He actually just sat on top of a dog right there. That is the smallest dog I've ever seen. That is definitely not a canine. It says that there's a police dog in there, but that's a very, very small police dog. What do you got over there? Like a miniature uh, German Shepherd? We're going to go ahead and search his vehicle and see what he had inside the vehicle over here. Let's do what other charges we could charge him with tonight. So he's got a speeding ticket. He's got an expired license. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Shotgun. At least he's a supporter of Ristream over there, but he's got a shotgun and he's got some funny smelling marijuana brownies as well. This guy's got a lot of weed in his pocket. Dispatch requesting a 1051. Let's tow him out of here. Send out a tow truck over here on US Route 13 at the 145 mile marker. Tow truck. Assistance required on, um... All right. We're going to go ahead and uh, check out that weapon that he did have inside the vehicle and see if that's a stolen weapon. Let me call that in. Thomas Indigo 00312 Henry is the serial number. Officer Stolen. Brown Stolen. Stars. Not Jail time. Lane. Uh, not getting notifications. Joshua, you know what? I've been. I was wondering where you were at this weekend. I was honestly wondering where you're at. Type in explanation point notify. I know Facebook is definitely broken on my end over here, so it could still be broken. Gabriel was getting uh, his notifications turned back on as well. Facebook has been acting really, really funky lately. All right, I just wanted to push him out of the way so traffic could start rolling. Come on, guys. Let's go. Everybody start rolling. So the vehicle's towed out of there. I'm going to go ahead and hop back in my car. I'm going to tell Steve to go ahead and get back in his car. So there goes Steve. He's going to hop back inside of his Ford F-150. And I am going to go ahead and kill my radar for a second and come over to our computer here. And we're going to go ahead and pull up Mr. James Marsh. James Marsh is going to get a speeding ticket today for going 18 over. He's got a document charge for the expired registration on the vehicle. Oh, no. Not expired registration. Expired driver's license fire driver's license over there um and he's also going to get arrested tonight for driving under the influence of alcohol uh bah, 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 bah. he has got possession illegal possession of a firearm possession of stolen property for that stolen firearm and what else did he do did something else i believe guys what else did he do oh the marijuana drug possession of the marijuana possession of the devil's lettuce over here possession of the devil's lettuce all right, there we go. We got it. He's got a lot of charges tonight. Let's go ahead and kill our lights, and we're going to be 10-6. Dispatch, show me as 10-6. We're out of here, dude. Roll out. 
Roger. Roll out. Here we go. Bada bang, bada boom. Easy peasy, Japanesey. Uh, Mark Circo over there with the knucklehead. He stole my weed, man. We've got a citizen's report. A robbery in, uh, Galileo Park. Galileo Park, dude. That's kind of far. All right, we'll go to it. 10-4. We're streaming route. Galileo Park is quite far away, so we're gonna kind of gonna just cheat a little bit and spawn ourselves over there because we don't have time for that. But we're in route for a robbery. In route. All right, John. Ten four, copy that. One eight. Really don't need our sirens for this one since it's a robbery, but oh well. Josh Watson. Shane says, uh, right on, dude. We only a couple days apart on that one. Yeah, yeah, I know. Shane actually uh, shared. Officer Chase Reed responded Shared a with video. 500 stars. Rish, you are the best streamer on Facebook. Thank you, Chase Reed. I appreciate that, buddy. Dude, big old tan for man. Positive comments like that are definitely go a long way. All right. So this guy apparently got robbed. And it looks like there's a dog up here. We're on scene. Dispatch, show me as investigating code 6. He's got his hands up in the air. I don't know why. 10-4. And backup required. Negative. All right. We're on scene right now. Copy Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Ristream says, hello, I'm Officer Ristream. Are you doing all right? He says, uh-oh, officer, please help me. Uh, what happened, I say. Someone just robbed me. Are you hurt? How may I help you, Ristream says. I'm fine, I just want to go ahead and go home. Okay, well, um, do you want me to go ahead and... I guess I'll give you a ride home, dude. Uh, we'll go ahead and give you a ride home. Uh, but before I do that, let me see if I can go ahead and get his identification. Let me get your identification uh, from him first, and then we'll see if we go ahead and give him a ride home. Thanks. His name is Brian Shepard. Nice. Brian Shepard, are you in the stream today, buddy? I know he's definitely here. He's got that new profile picture, one of our first comments of the stream today. Brian Shepard, we got you over here, dude. Let's make sure that Brian doesn't have any. Uh-oh, I'm calling somebody on the phone here. I don't know who I'm calling. Brian Shepard, he doesn't have any warrants or anything like that, so he's good to go. Brian, are you still here, dude? Attention Let me know. I actually called Officer him a taxi cab. PMDRN My bad. Responded with 1, My bad. Stars. Mods, great job, but I'm done for now. Great job. Absolutely. Great job tonight, Mods. Good, 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 good. Thank you, Ken. I appreciate that, Bombski. Big old tan for. Thanks for helping out tonight. I know that you're not feeling well. Hopefully, I see you tomorrow. Okay. So, the taxi cab did come, but I think he's going to still get inside my car. Let's see. Brian Shepard, I don't know if he's going to actually get inside my car with me over here. No, Brian, Brian's not going to go ahead and get in my car with me over here. All right, Brian, I'll go ahead and call you another taxi cab out here. We'll try to, at least. All right, there he goes. Now he's getting in the cab. Good, good, good. Officer Jeremy Tessier responded with 100 stars. Last time you were at this location, there was a big shootout. Yeah. Uh, was, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There was uh, something to do with... Uh, something to do with, like, there was a breach at the uh, radio tower or something like that. Dispatch were code 4. Yeah, I remember that. And I, and I got shot a couple times. All units. Code four. No additional support needed. Show me as 10 6 as well. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and uh, do a power Roger slide here. One, eight. I'm going to go ahead and check this vehicle here real quick. Dispatch, show me in a traffic stop. Go ahead. We're going to make sure that this vehicle is not abandoned. Dispatch, let me get a plate check. 03 Sam Ocean David 205, please. Officer Brandon Freeman responded with 200 stars. 03 Sam Ocean. Brandon, thank you, buddy. I appreciate that. 205. All right, so this is the Regina over here. Uh, valid insurance, valid insurance. Vanessa Starr owns the vehicle. Vanessa Starr has I know, a warrant for looting, but Vanessa is not inside the vehicle. But it's not occupied, so we're just gonna go ahead and leave that vehicle parked right there. I just wanted to make sure it didn't have, uh, it wasn't stolen or anything like that. We'll make our way back down to the city down here. Adrian says hi. Joe says, "What game is this? It's called Grand Theft Auto 5." All right, let's uh, make our way down here, guys. Attention, making our way downtown. Officer Chase Reed responded with 245 stars. Rishima, head out. All right, brother. Thank you for the positive compliments, bro. All right, guys, we got a bicycle in pursuit. 5025 mount and drive. Okay, we're going to go ahead and be in route to that call. Dispatch, we're streaming route. 10 4, copy. 1 8. Um, now, the problem with this one is that there's two red. Let's see. I don't know. If... No. Who's this? That is definitely not the bicycle. I don't know why there's two red dots here. 
Okay, there he is. Got him. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Jessica Marie joined the department. We got him. Thank you, Jessica. I appreciate that. Looks like Jessica was able to go ahead and swipe that. Where the frig did he go? Oh, he turned around. He's running. Dispatch requesting air support. He's in a stolen bicycle. He's way up there. See him up there? All right. We're going to go ahead and run after him. I do not want to run over here, guys. I do not feel like doing this right now. Because <laughs> he's going to go ahead and take off from us. We do got a helicopter up in the air. Let me get back up. Dispatch requesting backup. And I might not be able to catch him. Let's move over to our sniper. Drop it! Dude, right in the friggin' butt. We are code four. He's down. <laughs> Attention all units. Threat has been neutralized. He's neutralized. He's good to go. Alright, 10 4. Dispatch requesting a 1052, please. Let me see if I can go ahead and drag him down to the bottom of the Ambulance. hill here. Assistance required in, uh, uh, Galileo that Park. was a freeway. Yeah, that was the freeway down there. I don't understand why there was a red dot down there. There was some random guy standing down there. I don't know if that was supposed to be something else. All right, let me move him a little bit. And we'll just wait till the ambulance. Oh, never mind. Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He's sliding. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> He's sliding down the hill right now. This is insane. I've never had this happen before. <laughs> like it's a sheet of ice. All right, let's go ahead and see who this guy's name was here while the ambulance rolls up on scene. I don't know where the ambulance is at. He's somewhere around here. Uh, Jeremy Red, <laughs> Nicholas Kane over there, Jeremy Barnett, Brian Shepard. All right, he's got a smoking apparatus with a carb. This is Mr. Tom West over here. Let's go ahead and pull up Tom West in the computer. And we'll see uh, if he's wanted or anything like that. Nope, he doesn't have any citations or anything like that. Apparently, that bike that he was riding over there, uh, he stole it. I'm going to go ahead and spawn the... Uh... Where's my 1052? All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and call a... Uh... We're going to call an air ambulance out ambulance. here. Ambulance. Assistance required in uh, Galileo Park. I'm going to throw a flare on the ground here. We're going to stop traffic. Dispatch uh, requesting traffic control. That car was flying down here. Attention all units. Officer requesting traffic control. All right, guys. We got traffic control Galileo coming down right Park. now. Case Reed says, Rich, can you follow me, please? I can't follow anybody on my page over here. This is just a, a Facebook page. So you can just follow me over there. Unfortunately, I can't follow anybody over there. Uh, Keith says, uh, Will, you want to get him down there? Well, you wanted to get him down there, I think is what you're trying to say. Yeah, I did. Alex says, how do I play this game? Go to my Discord, explanation point Discord in the chat. Are you beating people up again, says Wanta? Uh, I shot him with a sniper rifle, but yeah, I guess so. All right, air ambulance is here. Let's go ahead and see if... Uh... Oh, my backup officer is finally here. It's about time he got here, Baldy. Bald-headed John's over here, guys. There's bald-headed John. Why? Jaybird's laughing. Shane's over there. Brandon filters with his follow of the 362 days. Thanks for all the followages in the chat, guys. I appreciate that. You guys are in the stream and not a follower. Make sure you do hit that follow button. Show some love. The wrist stream and the BCE. Explanation point notified for your notifications. Jessica Marshall, Shane Wilbur claiming their points. All right, he's dead. Dispatch requesting a 1079. All right, we're out of here. You want to go ahead and just watch over that situation? Since you didn't do a darn thing and it took you forever to get here. Oh, this guy's drunk. This guy's actually drunk. I have never had a backup officer show up drunk to the scene before guys have you guys ever seen this before a drunk backup officer <laughs> you're a real talk a crap talker aren't you i guess so all right corners here uh red says what the heck yeah that was actually our first uh ever drunk backup officer uh, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Herb's got the 21 days of followed out there. Shwasted. Yep. Shwasted he was. Adrian Red says test. I can't test officers. But he's definitely drunk, guys. Look at the way he's standing. Yeah. He, he looks like he's going to friggin' hurl. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go check that bike out down here. There goes the air ambulance up in the sky. Uh, Jamie Goldberg says, I'm back. Welcome back to the stream. Ryan says, give him a breathalyzer. Unfortunately, I can't, which is that that's the crappy part. Attention I can't do anything with the backup. Okay. So Tom West died, so it really doesn't matter if this is stolen or not. But let's go ahead and take a look at the bike. Dispatch requesting a plate check. Let's look at the serial number here. 4675 
994. Not showing that it's stolen. Not showing that it's stolen over there. See if I can pull that VIN number up over here. No, I can't pull that VIN number up. Apparently, they said it was stolen, but it doesn't seem to be stolen. Dispatch requesting a 1051, please. I'm going to call a pickup truck out here to go ahead and pick this up out of here. Dispatch requesting a 1051, please. I'm on Mount Hand Drive out here. Can you send out a uh, pickup truck, please? Pick this up. Assistance required. And I wish uh, I wish I could actually put this on the back of my car. That would be super dope like that, uh, that one I was using on the Ranger stream the other day. Must have been Paul Blart. <laughs> Sell the bike, says Sean. Uh, well, I don't want to get in trouble for, for taking the bike and selling it. All right, there's the pickup truck back there. I don't know why this, this traffic is all stopped right here. Like, they can't get around me. But the uh, pickup truck is right there. They got the bike in the back. I'm going to be code 4. Dispatch, we're code 4. Make our way out to the highway. We'll go ahead and run a couple more radars. Attention all units. Code 4. No additional code four. needed. Code 4. Uh, Ray Simpson. Mark says, uh, what seems to be the problem, officer? Yeah, I don't know. What seems to be the problem out there, officer? Hopefully he's good to go. Where's the highway? How do I get back to the highway? I don't really remember. I have to map this out. Hold we on, we got a problem. Grand Theft Auto and Bay Tree Canyon. Bay Tree Canyon. All right. Dispatch, we're streaming out. I think it's behind us. Ten four one eight. So apparently this one says it's a low value vehicle in pursuit. Doesn't give me a reason why they're running though. Dispatch ten eighty. Gonna be this vehicle right here. Ten four. Copy that. See if we get authorization for the pursuit. Attention all units. Target spotted. Eastbound. Driving a, uh, a pickup truck for a bicycle? Uh, yeah. It's either a pickup truck or a flatbed. So I figured the pickup truck would be a little bit more logical. Killed for nothing, says Red. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, he was killed for nothing on that one. They told me it was stolen, though, when they called it out on the radio. So I should have tased them, but oh well. Dispatch. Dispatch. We got a visual on the curb. All right, we got a visual, guys. We got a visual. We're going to get a pit maneuver. Dispatch requesting a pit. We do have authorization for the pursuit. David Charles, 12, copy. Dispatch requesting a pit. Attention all units. Officer requesting backup near um, Vinewood Hills. Respond code 2. Dispatch. Oh, my God. He's going to hit a deer. Oh, oh, my. I almost hit a deer, too. That was close. All right. Target heading south, doing 40 miles per hour in Vinewood Dude, he's like going less than 40 miles an hour. Look at our speedometer over there. He's only going 25. All right, let me get these uh, plates checked over here. Dispatch, let me get a plate check over here. Two, two Bravo, three. I can't really read that. Two, eight, Charles. Sam, Charles, three, two, zero. A traffic felony. Traffic felony. Okay, let's pit him out. Stop right there in the name of the law, sir. Stop right there. Pull it over, dude. All right. We're going to see if we go ahead and grab him, guys. Here we go. Bada bang, bada boom. It's all yours when you want it. Hit maneuver. Got him. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. Stop. Nope. He's going to keep rolling. There goes another officer behind him. Dispatch. Requesting spikes. Oh. Backup officer got him. He's stuck on a tree. Stop right there. Get out of the car. He's got his hands up. He is cooperating. Driver, get outside the car with your hands up. Step out. Step out or we will shoot. We know what happened before. <laughs> we know what happened before when this happened. Yeah, it was absolutely wild. Ah, oh, crap. It crashed on us. All right. Well, I think that was good right there. That was definitely some fun pursuits. I'll be using a different vehicle next time, guys. We'll go ahead and fly Air Force One around a little bit over here and see what kind of damage we can get done. Wait a minute. We got a birthday in the chat? Who's birthday? Brian Kingpin Smith. I didn't know it was your friggin' birthday, man. Happy birthday, dude. Happy birthday, man. Hopefully, you're having a fantastic day today. Happy birthday to Brian Kingpin Smith. Happy birthday. I don't have any confetti over here, but everybody down in the chat, say happy birthday. The Brian Kingpin Smith over there, guys. Happy birthday, buddy. Happy birthday, my man. Big old tan four, guys. Drop me some uh, drop me some GG's in the chat, man. Drop me some GG's over here. That definitely a good game over there today, guys. Definitely a good game. Had a lot of fun with that one. Super fire. Uh, Don Bennett, Red, Bald-Headed John, uh, Steven Marcella.
Don over there. Don, thank you, man, for the GGs, brother. I definitely appreciate that. Fantastic job today. Fantastic job. What's that noise? What's that noise, guys? Does anybody hear anything that's a little bit too loud over here on the screen? I hear something that's way too loud over here. What is it? Uh, Nick Hashback, Sharon Spicer, Dominic. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. Anybody that I didn't say hello to, make sure you comment on the stream because I want to make sure I can go ahead and try to go ahead and see your comments over here. What an awesome stream today. Yeah, I think that was an awesome stream today. Jaybird, Dizzy, Brad Stone says Air Force One. Wish Force One. You know what? I might actually I might actually change this. I might actually change it to Rish Force One since you guys are always saying that. Or BCE Force One or something like that. That would be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Alright guys, let's go ahead and slow motion. We'll go ahead and get our wheels up. We're gonna land this baby in the desert. Whenever I land in the desert though, usually we blow up. Maybe I'll throw some pipe bombs over here as well. Danny, Eric Gibson, Jeremy sounds like Ristream. Ristream's vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I know. It didn't have it does have a weird sound to it if you don't know exactly what I'm doing over here. Brian, happy birthday, buddy. He says when in doubt, pipe bombs out. Yeah, when in doubt, pipe bombs out. Alright guys, let's go ahead and grab some altitude here. We'll go ahead and see if we go ahead and do a triple barrel roll over here as well. Dougie Deb over there says we're in danger. Yeah, we're most likely in danger if we're gonna go ahead and land it out in the desert. Uh James Elliott Bradstone says uh Adam Nunlery already says are you gonna be on tomorrow? Yeah, yeah. I'm usually on every single day, except for Sundays. But this Sunday I actually did come on and I did run a convoy, a convoy so Yep, I'll be on tomorrow. Officer Elijah Fast responded with 100 stars. Hey, Rish, it was my birthday on the 7th. I was busy on my birthday what? working. Oh, okay. Well, happy belated, brother. Happy belated birthday over there, dude. Big old pan for Elijah Fast and Brian Kingpin over there. We'll go ahead and celebrate both your birthdays in the chat there one time. Big old tan for to both of you guys. Uh, Mark Circle says, always a good ending when on the wrist stream. Always a good ending on the wrist stream. That's right. All right. But all raw. Beautiful. There's the Hollywood sign in the background back there. There is an airport over here that we're going to blow up some cars. Timothy. Oh, tomorrow's Taco Tuesday as well, guys. Yes. Tomorrow is Taco Tuesday. My plan is to come on a little earlier tomorrow. I don't. I, uh, I should be home a little earlier tomorrow, so I should be able to go ahead and do that. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, slow motion. And we're going to go ahead and get the wheels down. Landing gear down, dude. Landing gear down. Landing gear down. Landing gear down. All right. Pivot. I think the airport's somewhere over here, guys. I think the airport's somewhere over here. Yep, right over there. We have to swing this kind of wide, though. Uh, Stativa, Oz, Bald Headed John, Ray Simpson with the GGs, Jamie, and Jaybird says fire stream as well. Thank you, guys. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I appreciate all those positive, positive comments tonight, guys. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, guys, we do have our wheels down. We are approaching the landing here. Let's see if Ray Stream can do this without crashing over here tonight. Here we go. This is a small runway as well. Here we go. All right, here we go. Bada bang, bada boom. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. I don't know. I don't know. Well, Jessica Marie, Sharon Spicer over there, Shane Wilbur over there as well. One of our brand new members to our wrist stream community down here. Brad says, absolute fire stream again today, wrist stream. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. I wish we had some more high speed pursuits. We had four of them. But I wish there was more, but oh well, what are you going to do? Uh, Brad Stone says, peace out, Ristream. Thank you so much. Steven Flieger, thanks for the big old finger. Derek Colwell, Raymond Page, Anthony says, thanks for making my day better. Thank you so much, man. I love bringing the positive energy to the stream over here. So if it definitely helps you out, I definitely will try to do it more. Uh, Jeremy Tesler, Raymond Page, uh, and I think I got all of you guys over there. Anthony uh, over there as well. Steven Flieger. Lisa Howard says, catch you on the next one, Ristream. We'll catch you on the flip-flop. Don't stop being awesome, guys. Everybody have a good day when you get to it. Let's see if Shorty's on. Let's go ahead and go all over and say hi to Shorty. Bottom left-hand corner of the screen, guys. Say hello to Shorty, one of our awesome supporters as well. And have a good night, guys. Peace out. Oh. We might have got race miles on this one. Welcome Raiders in chat. Rich stream. I appreciate the raid, buddy. What are you doing? Don, what's up, buddy? Thank you for the like. <laughs>